Yeah. All right, four windows four. are all rolled up. All right. When? Four. Oh, so pretty soon. Yeah. Yeah, but you know, you know how we do it. Is that a bar or where is it's it? It's well, uh, like a, a, a vent kind of place. You'd know more than me, Roach, on that one. What's it yeah, like? Yeah, the place is cool. I saw Jana dance there actually like a month ago, and it's the bottom has a stage, open bar. I think there's a restaurant and something else, and like an open air bar at the very top. I think it's like the after the, after the movie. Everybody's They'll probably going to show the movie on the downstairs section. That's what he said. Yeah. That's what he said. Because there's a the full bar going upstairs after. Or something. Yeah. Like okay, so here we go. First question. I want both of your answer. You know, so and you got to remember. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna walk through this a little bit. All right. So first number one question. If you could have a three or four hour session, and it was just the two of you out. Just and you, us. Just the two of you guys out. What would be the break you would go to, and there would be nobody out? Now remember, I mean, like, sing, you know, Secret Spot or, you know, like uh, Natividad. Kind of doesn't really count because those places are kind of empty anyways. Yeah. So like something the like. Problem you know, is Paul's been to so many fucking spots. <laughs> but I mean, I but mean there's that. spots that are crowded, right, Paul? It's like even a local spot. That's you know, I mean, like on the whether it's day. Wedge or Pipe or Seal Beach, yeah. like completely empty. Only two guys out, three to four hours. What's the spot? I don't know what's a spot that goes both ways equally as good. I don't know, man. That's a hard one. I be mean, warm. It's gotta be warm. Something gotta be warm. warm. Oh, maybe just probably like D bar or something. Pipe. Pipe back to pipe. pipe. Well, that, yeah, up. I was kind of thinking pipe would be a good one because, because it's you like got a perfect left and a perfect right. But yeah. Rafi, you've been to D bar, so you would know better. I mean, does it get crowded? It gets oh, it gets crowded, crowded, but no one's out. Remember. That's what I'm saying. So that's a good spot to pick because mm -hmm. you're never right, going to get that spot. Right. Empty, right? You rarely okay. get it empty. All right. And Roach, you're saying pipe? Yeah, but I'd take either one of them. Does d -Bot got a left on it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. It's 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 and it's a little more low pressure. It's not as heavy of a wave. It's the corner. It's even better, I think. And is it like less heavy of a wave? Like, like It's not so know scary. It's better now. It's like that's snapper. more towards like a pier. There's like a pier that goes out. Oh, Fingal. Fingle. That's where Matt uh, yeah, gets all crossed go. up yeah. up there. That gets pretty good. It's okay, so you would, so is points. it officially would it be Deba or know. Pipe? Both. <laughs> Alright, we'll settle for a tie on that one. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Because <laughs> one's a little more <laughs> one's heavier. One's yeah, one's sandbar. a little scarier. Alright, Ra Rafi, what got you into the sport of bodyboarding? Uh I'd have to say my brothers. Okay, right, because they're already into it. Yeah, they moved out here a few years before I did, and so they were in the water for a couple years already, and then when I got here, they dragged me out there. So when you hit the scene, it was on? Like, you're like, I'm going to be going to the beach. You guys live close at that time? Oh, yeah, we get dropped off at Moonlight Beach. Okay. And, you know, down there all day long. All right, nice. Roach, what about you? What do Into we... bodyboarding? Yeah. Um, I think uh, Mark Morgan and Kevin Serve. Greg Abbott. They were just guys when we moved to Encinitas when I was a drama. I was surfing already, but they were the kind of the first friends I met at the beach. And uh, they just told me to try it out. It was pretty cool. Okay, question number three. Do you think you will ever get invited, and this one's for Roach, to the Kelly Slater Wave Park? No. Is that's never gonna happen? Absolutely not. Oh my And now God. if you got the call and he's like, Roach, I want you to come out. Although he's been bodyboarding his own way. Well, <laughs> has he? Yes. Is it? He cut off Kalani, uh, uh, Kalani Rob the That's other epic. Day. Yeah. He like snaked him super hard prone. That's pretty good. It was pretty that. deadly. So your answer is no, you will never be. I will never be invited. To the Kelly Center Wave Park. No. Well, okay, so we're going to jump to a sub What if you said sorry? <laughs> well, <laughs> sorry for fucking rounding you up. You know, it's like a lot of girls say, Rafi, sometimes sorry just ain't going to do it. It's not going to cut it. No, no. All right, so hey, so then that means we're pretty stoked though because, you know, they're building a wave park out in uh, Ocean Palm Springs. Right by the wood shop. Okay, yeah. and one in Palm Springs too, I heard. Yep, that's really? the Kalani Rob, Shane Magnuson one. Yeah, that's going to be done this summer. And then their Kelly Slater 2.0 is going in like a block away from our cabinet shop in Ocean Really? Park. Really? Yeah. That's a Kelly uh, wave? What? Yeah. So, what do you think? Will ever is it going to be open to the public or not? Yeah. 
no way. <laughs> yeah, but it costs like five. freaking five thousand dollars a day. Right. All right. <laughs> kind of fucking crazy. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to How call. How are we gonna do that? We gotta get like local fucking discounts. Well, what we gotta do is we gotta call that calf from Tropicali. I heard he's got a big budget. He's gonna oh, spring for the whole off. thing. Fuck <laughs> off. Okay. So okay, that was kind of question number four. Uh, let's see. Greatest session in bodyboarding you ever had? What spot? What place? Ever? Any? Yeah, just yeah. like well, with that one session where you're like, man, that was just it. Oh, it I went know. all day. You know, maybe you were single bad. at the time. You know, no, no disruptions, no stresses. Like you're like, man, that was just it, yeah. man. It's gonna be hard to beat that. What would you say that is that? I know mine. Go I, for it. Go. I went down to Puerto Escondido with Jeff Flint once, and it was just me and him. And there was a day, probably like six to eight foot Porto. Scary at all, or no? Just yeah, it solid. Was right at the right level, of not scary. Right. It was so perfect, and yeah, I must have shot like this is back when there were rolls of film. <laughs> I probably shot like. 30 or 40 rolls of film in one day. This is when it was all slide film and everything. It was so crazy. It was... Yeah, and he gave me a bunch of prints, and I somehow I lost them out of bag of like 200 prints, and everything was like the best, you know? Okay. That was the best ever. All right, Rafi, you, what's going on? What, what, what do you think of your best session was? Ever. Wow. That's was it Australia, D Ba, Lackey? Was no. it? No. I've had some good sessions there, but... Was it with Will George? Definitely not ever. Was your best session with Will George? Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Well, it's hard to see the break with that big beard getting in the way, I tell you. <laughs> different kind of <laughs> session. You got, yeah, different what kind of session for sure. Surf session? You know what? Okay. Fish? We'll get off to Sizzler. So, wait, what's going What's mm -hmm. going on? Then, uh, what would you say your best session was? With, like, Seaside, maybe? Or maybe a day at Pally? No. 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 Maybe, like, a Velzy. Day or ooh, ooh. Uh, Rocky Point. That's okay, I get days that. At Rockies, but and it's cool because the water's all kick-ass warm and oh, it's yeah. so clear. And it's, all right, yeah, man. So what, what? This is a good one. You both have had cover shots. What was it like to get your first cover shot? What was the first cover shot? What was it like to get your first cover shot? I don't even remember. That was like 65 years ago. <laughs> so long ago uh, right right but it, yeah i think uh i think i was working for it pretty hard so it felt good when i got finally got it and was that with maury yeah i was definitely riding for maury i was riding for body gloves so i definitely had right. like a fluorescent wetsuit on yeah, they had it, it met all the criteria to making cover yeah you were just shredding and maybe even quicksilver at that time so, dang those but some was, good brands you know, i think i was probably like uh 15, maybe 16. Wow. Rafi, what, you were about, you were older than that though, right? Like, yeah, I was like uh, 18 maybe. 18? Yeah. Hawaii, right? Yep. And so that was a pretty good trip? <coughs> that was a great trip. So did you know that when you were getting back that you possibly like had a cover or is that just something that you like? No, I had no idea. I, you know, I just went up there just to catch waves. And and next thing you know, you get home and the you're... The fuzz was getting on the freeway on the right back there. All right. Oh, it was? Okay. I see. Perfect. All right, well... So, very, very unexpected. Not, you know, I had no clue. And I so... I just got a call from someone. Who shot said, it? Who shot the cover? I couldn't tell you. Was it Flynn know. or one of those guys? Or? Eichner, mate. No, not Eichner. Uh, one of the dudes that worked for bodyboarding. And so... Scott Weiner, maybe? Scott Weiner, when is, so like, when did One you know that you had the cover? Like, before it was coming out, or no? When uh, after it came just out? Just before, yeah, somebody said, well, they said you were up for it. And I right. guess it was, like, between uh, Wonton and myself. You're like, I want, and, I want it so bad. And no, I had no idea. Well, you're and probably kind of like, wow, I can't really? believe it. I yeah, yeah. honored and, and shocked. You know, I had, I, I couldn't but believe it. John. You know, right. really. Okay. All right, well. But it was, you know, it was incredible. Well, let's wrap it, it up. Great, this, great feeling. I'll see, let's wrap it up. we got this highway patrol over here, and we're sipping on our iced teas. And uh, we got to get to the thing for Vargas here. You made the call. Oh, this is a Vargas thing. This is, well, it's kind of like, you know, realistically. So you're going to try to play it tonight? 
I, no, this is what I'm saying. Yeah, they're playing this movie tonight. The thing that kind of sucks is no, like, this what interview? interview? No, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> I gotta fucking go edit this. No, thing. dude, I gotta get back in the lab. Make I'm like, scene. man, there's the fuzz. Put the ball yeah. in there. <laughs> Fucking big smoke cloud coming yeah. through. Well, that's what I'm saying. You gotta be I careful. Right? Up, yeah. man. I'm already fucking high as a All right, we'll wrap it up then. <laughs> I don't know if we lost it. Got that, kept that at it. Let's see if this kept it. Oh, yeah, that is.